My name is, is John Vines and I'm an engineering lead and part of our data leadership team here at AO.com. Uh, AO.com is one of the UK's largest online electrical retailers. From a technical perspective, we wanted a cloud native enterprise grade infrastructure that would allow us to combine historical customer data with real time digital signals from our customers as well. And we wanted to be able to use that to deliver um, highly personalized um, customer interactions effectively on site. So being able to use um, that data as it's happening within the context of the organization. There was a desire to move into uh, Confluent Cloud because that gave us a fully managed solution for um, Kafka as a whole. Um, so that gave us a number of benefits, including reducing operational overhead within the team and maintenance of those clusters, allowing the team to focus on delivering value and, and removing ind undifferentiated heavy lifting effectively. Uh, and that in turn helped us lower the, the total cost of ownership of the team. And what we were trying to deliver became business value giving rather than maintaining a Kafka cluster alongside it. Having Confluent Cloud and on AWS has allowed us to achieve um, quite a few things. Um, our biggest use case at the moment is um, giving us real-time access to Clickstream events as they're happening. From a business perspective, that gives us that opportunity to have kind of a real-time contextualized, personalized use case, which in turn has demonstrated a conversion uplift and a, and a revenue uplift as well. The big opportunities that we've realized with, with both having Kafka as a managed service um, and the AWS um, managed services alongside that as well, is that we can take advantage of, of the scalability that those cloud native approaches to building our applications gives us. So being able to respond not only to um, what a user's doing, but technically um, being able to respond to traffic levels as they go up and down or specific events as they happen throughout the year, such as, as, as Black Friday. The big benefits that we're looking at from an architectural standpoint um, means that we can start to, to kind of formally share data across the organization uh, with our events, with the contracts defining schema registry. Um, that in turn aids things like discoverability and governance and that kind of stuff. But the, the big thing is um, giving us an ability to decouple application architecture and modernize where appropriate. Uh, explore new opportunities where possible. We can start to integrate with a number of existing applications using Kafka Connect, um, taking data from places like SQL Server, from MongoDB, um, but also start to create new application footprints with some cloud native options in AWS, including technologies like Fargate, um, Lambda and S3, what we can do with, with Confluent and what's available in AWS is, has been some of the biggest benefits that we've seen.